Hey guys, Judah Dora here. I have two Funko items to show you guys today, plus two t-shirts that I bought. I will start with the Funko items first. And I have the first one here. I got it from Toys R Us. Um, the box was damaged, but there was only two left, and this was the least damaged, and I really wanted Yzma. I think that's how you say her name. Uh, but uh, it is 2021 Fall Con Convention Limited Edition. Um, and that's the number. She's in the Girl Guides outfit holding on to an acorn. She's part of this set. I'll put her on the turntable now. <laughs> Happy to have her. I love the new Emperor's new groove. I do have Cusco somewhere up here. I've shown him before. Also another Yzma that I'll also put the links down in the description um, after. And then I got Sora! Cusco! No tachi. <laughs> uh, it is not open. Um, it was on the more pricey side. It was $25 to get this, but I kind of went back and forth. Do I want it? It's like I do love Cusco, so I ended up going back and get it. <laughs> so we shall see if this is my first chase. Um, if it is a chase, I might not open the bag because I don't know if that devalues it at all. I'm not sure. Let me know in the comments. <laughs> Let's see if I can get this open. Okay. And we got I'm not sure. It's colored one. I don't think it is. I think the numbers would be a lot lower for that if it was the the chase. But I th maybe it is. I don't know. I guess I'll be opening it anyways, because <laughs> I thought the um, comments came with a white one, so this one might actually be flawed. <laughs> I'm curious now. I have issues getting them out of the bubble wrap. Okay, he's not flock, so it's common. But he's super cute. I can add him to my collection. I'll put him on the turntable now. So I'm happy to have him. I, I know the commons are definitely nowhere near the amount that you actually pay for the can before you open it. But I'm happy to have him in my collection. Um, then now, the t-shirts that I have to show you today. Um, I let my husband open uh, the bag. But it was super cute. Came with a hot dog and I'm guessing mustard or ketchup bottle on there. It's from Red Bubble. I think it's a Canadian company. It did come from Ontario, so I'm not entirely sure. I like how it, on here it says artwork by Dino Mike. I'm assuming it means this artwork. Very cool. And it also came with stickers. A gypsy. And I thought the clothing warning was pretty funny because the very last one it says don't slap pandas. <laughs> so I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> What I ordered was two shirts. I got one for the hubby. It says avoid the Noid because he goes by Noid. Uh, also, we do have the Funko Pop, but he doesn't want to open it to get the t-shirt. So it's remaining in its uh, pizza box and everything like that because 
He doesn't like opening those. <laughs> and I got... No, touchy! <laughs> I got them super big. I didn't know how they would fit. I got both of them extra large. Um, I figure I'd probably sort of grow into it later. I, as of tomorrow, I'm 19 weeks, so I am showing a little bit, but not much. So, I wanted to get something that uh, would hopefully get the point across that I don't want to be touched at work. Don't pet me. <laughs> kind of, sort of, it's kind of big, but I'll probably put like a hair tie thing here. And it'll eventually work. It'll keep people away. <laughs> but yeah, that is what I have to show you guys today. Uh, there should be another video next week sometime. We do have the gender ultrasound March 2nd. I believe that's next week. My computer kind of froze. I'm trying to see the date. Yeah, next week, uh, March 2nd. Uh, we'll see if I post it. Um, if I don't, um, it, it's hard to say. Um, my dad goes into surgery on, I think, the 28th. So we'll see how that surgery goes. And if it all goes well, then I'll probably be up to making a video. But if I go MIA for a while and <laughs> well I'll try to eventually post it but until then take care guys and see you later guys